Bear sightings are they're not that uncommon. Most people in the small town of Elba have never seen a bear. I have never seen a bear come into town or anything like that. But 15 minutes away from Johnny's Saloon in the marshy bluffs of Whitewater State Park, Lisa Christensen and her daughter Emmy were pleasantly surprised to see this black bear come wandering out of the woods Tuesday night. It actually gave me a little pleasure getting to actually get the photos of the bear. You heard me right. I said pleasantly. That's because Lisa is an avid nature photographer. Back in 2008, we followed Lisa through these very same woods, photographing and documenting the daily habits of bald eagles. So I jumped out and I grabbed my camera and shot a half a dozen shots. There he is. As Lisa was snapping still photos, 10-year-old Emmy grabbed her video camera and started rolling. I think it was my first bear sighting. She had no problem being just 100 yards away from a black bear. It's actually like a little surprise, like Christmas, where you kind of hoping to get something and you get something good and all that. Like a bear. Yeah. <laughs> One theory is that maybe the bear came from Wisconsin. It might have crossed the Mississippi before the ice melted or even swam. There are, of course, other ideas as to where the black bear might have come from. You think this bear was a Chicago fan and started out, but look at the bears, man. <laughs> <laughs> black bears usually don't wander more than 15 miles from their den. Lisa believes this one probably lives nearby. It's probably heading up into the hills where he knows there's a, a food source. Maybe there's a farm up there. For the most part, these bears don't care for people, which is why Lisa feels lucky she now has new photos to add to her collection.